Hi there. Today, I'm going to show you how to draw an elephant. One big circle, two smaller circles, a few other shapes, and bingo, you've got yourself an elephant. Super fast, super easy. If you watch to the end, I will show you more from the A4 Alpaca app. We can pop the elephant into 3D. Right, that's enough screen time within screen time for now. To make it incredibly easy for everyone to follow along, all the animals are made from four simple shapes. A circle, a square, a rectangle, a triangle, and a line. Now I do know a line is not a shape like the others. It's really helpful when we're creating these animals. Let's turn the paper over and talk about circles. Now all the animals start with a circle. A quick freehand circle, doesn't have to be perfect. Or, if you want to cheat a little bit, you can draw around something circular, like a toy plate maybe, or a cup. Just place it on the paper, put your finger on it, draw around it. You'll end up with a perfect circle. Now there is a secret way to draw a perfect circle freehand, just using pen and paper which I will show you when we draw the elephant. Okay, clean piece of paper. Now our elephant needs a big circle right in the middle of the paper. I'm gonna show you a secret method for drawing a freehand circle. So I'm gonna place my finger in the middle of the paper, hold the pencil still, and then spin the paper round my finger, which should give us a perfect, or near enough perfect, freehand circle. There you go. Please try and keep it a secret. Now we need to draw a long, thin rectangle for the trunk, right in the middle of the circle. Either side of that, we're going to draw some smaller circles that will make the ears. Next, we're going to draw a semicircle to make the mouth. And just above that, we're going to have two small circles for the eyes. Now, we can't really have any eyes without eyebrows. So just above the eyes, we've got two small semicircles. And now to finish it off, we have part of a square for the feet. And there we have the pencil outline of our elephant. I'm gonna use a black marker to outline it. Just be careful it doesn't go through the paper. You might find yourself in a bit of bother. First, we're gonna do the trunk because it sits in front of the circle for the body. Once we've done that, we're going to follow the pencil line, the circle. And then each of the ears. Now it doesn't have to be perfect. Some imperfections give it personality which is not a bad thing. Then we're gonna do the mouth, which is partly hidden behind the trunk. And then the eyes, which we're just gonna fill in black. And follow this with the two eyebrows. Really simple. Just tidy that up a little bit. And the last thing to do are the feet. And there you have the outline of our elephant. All that's left to do is to add some colour. Now I'm going to use a light grey and a light purpley bluey grey. One thing you can do before you colour in is rub the pencil out. 
which is what I'm gonna do here. So let's have a little bit of music and get going. And there you have our elephant. Super simple, super quick. Hopefully everyone can easily follow along and create their own elephant. Now, I did promise that I'd show you more from the A for Alpaca app. If we drag in the elephant's trunk, pop them into 3D and place them somewhere. You can take a picture, you can make a little video, send it to someone, generally have a ton of fun with a funky little elephant or a big elephant depending on how big you want to make it now available on the app store it's not free but then nor is ice cream